okay, if there is a God, this video, I'm just questioning the existence of God and I'm questioning God and I have questions about God and I know so many of you do too. So this whole video is going to be a rant about the questions that I have about God if there is a God. Um, first off, if there is a God, why would God want us to worship him? Why would God want us to be thinking about God all the time? You know, me as a creator, someone who is into the arts and does what I do, every time I make something, I want to give something to someone and I want them to feel it and have a good time with it or relate to it. You know, I don't want people to worship me. You know, if you know that I did that thing, then you know that I did that thing. You know, that's all that I could maybe ask. And if you don't do that, I don't care either way. So why would God, this ultimate being that made all of this stuff and made the human eye and the brain and everything that we see around us, and even I myself, I still cannot call myself religious. I can't call myself an atheist. I can't call myself anything that has to do with labeling myself as anything. I can't say that I do because I don't label myself as anything but a human being. I'm only human. And that's what the SBN lifestyle really means. That's what this brand really means is that I am somebody, but I'm really nobody. You know, I have a lot of things that are uh, great and then a lot of things that ain't so great. And that's with every one of us. But for me to sit here and worship God all day and think, what is God thinking about me? Did I do something right today? Did I do something wrong today? You know, I would tell you to do the right things, but... We're so caught up in this God judging us thing. And we don't even know if there really, really is a God or what God really is. And if you say that you know, then sorry to say, my friend, whoever's watching, you're lying to yourself. It's this. It's your brain telling you that you know what you believe and you're not your beliefs. This is another thing. You're not your beliefs. And that's what I might name this. I don't know. It's hard to come up with names on my videos to get people to those videos because the things that I talk about and the things that are reality and are common sense and logic, not a lot of people are researching. So it's kind of hard to put a title or a description or something where I would like the people that, you know, are ignorant of a lot of things to come to this channel, you know, and a lot of you may not understand that because that's how this whole algorithm thing is. And, and I want to speak to more people about this, this God concept and this, uh, this conformity and so many other things that we're constantly thinking about and worrying about and we're contemplating. And what I say is, don't do that. Don't worry. Don't contemplate. Don't just do what you do and do it when you want to do it. And when you're not feeling it, don't do nothing. Just be what it is that you are. And that's what this is you, you don't have to boast with the SBN lifestyle this is me this is me I, I i don't know about everybody else i can't call you anything i can't say what you are or say what you're thinking because i have no idea what you're thinking everybody thinks so much different stuff today that 
logic is kind of out the window. You know, everybody believes in something and everybody thinks God to be this way or that way. And God did this for me, but he didn't do this for this group of people. You know, it's, it's the lunacy of God and religion, if you ask me, and these spiritual things. And I understand that a lot of you may still call yourself spiritual. And you, may, and you still may say, I believe all the time. You know, I believe in this. I believe in that. And I believe in myself that I can do this. You don't have to believe. But th there's no reason to believe. You only have right now, this very moment. That's all that each and every one of us has is right now and that's it and that's my message also that is the message we are only human we make mistakes we fail and learn from those mistakes none of us can judge one another because when we judge we're just judging ourselves that's all we're doing it's a reflection of our own stuff that we're seeing whatever that stuff is i don't know what your stuff is so why judge yourself there's no reason to even judge yourself anymore that's all graveyard game basically when you really mature as a person and i don't say that boastfully because i'm not better than you but when you really mature you know and realize that religion is is dead that is graveyard stuff you know that spirituality is dead that's graveyard stuff all that you have is this your mind that's it that is it that's all you have is your mind and now and you're only human like me and like you that's it that's all you have and this is what i'm gonna keep telling everybody on this channel the spn lifestyle because i am my brand i am only human i do make mistakes i fail and when i have something that's on my mind i'm going to tell you about it and i'm gonna give it to you openly I'm not going to put on a mask and a facade for you or anyone else to act like I'm something that I'm not. It's just not going to happen here. And that's what I would like you to do for yourself, but I can't do it for you. As bad as I would like to be able to do it for you, I can't flick that switch. I can't flick that on and off switch. You know, all I can tell you is be your own creator, create your own stuff and do your own thing. You know, don't you realize that life is so short that we only have years or decades maybe left of our lives to live? Do we really realize how short time really is? I've been in my apartment that I'm in now for three years, three years, and my time perception, it seems like a year and a half to me. You know, what I think is uh, four days is really a week and a half, or, you, you know, or what I thought was a week and a half was really almost three weeks. You know, it's kind of like my time perception is cut in half sort of. So I don't know what that stems from, but that's what it is. So, you know, just be creative. You know, if you draw, draw. If you do literature, do literature. If you, whatever you do best, do it. Whatever you do best, do it. Because there's nothing else to do. And I know this veered off the God subject, but why are we going to spend the rest of our lives thinking about a God or creator that might exist that is all powerful and made all of this. Why would we have to be thinking about 
God all the time or praising God. It's it's a waste of time. It's baggage. Do you think God that God needs your praise or needs like you to be thinking about God? God can do anything God wants to do if God is God and God is all powerful. So why would God Sorry for that thing on my face here. I just went in the bathroom and wiped my face off here. I got a thing on my face and that my perfectionism will drive me wild. Now I know I have a thing on my face in the video, but anyway, that's something that I'm trying to face or facing myself. I'm not trying to face it. I am facing it. And by facing my perfectionism and facing these thoughts of God, that's why I'm starting to do more things on this channel because I'm facing myself and I'm getting over my own fears. And I would like to think that that is helping people, but I don't know what it's doing. I have no idea what it's doing. You know, I'm just clueless as to what I may be doing or and I don't want it to seem like it's me doing it. I want you to do it for yourself, you. And ask yourself these questions because we don't have long to live. We don't have long to do things that we might want to do. And we ha how many of us just hold off and say, oh, I'll do it some other time. I've been saying this for 20 years. 20 more than 20 years more than 20 years i've been into music and i wrote my first poem when i was like four or five years old to my grandfather you know and he can't hear that well and i wrote something about him you know and it's been so long since i wanted to do this and i got my first drum machine at 14 and I'm 34, about to be 35 in a little bit. And I'm just now, just now, 20 years later in 2020, 2020, 2020, <laughs> that's pretty cool, am doing what I want to do in my life. And I'm not thinking about what the rest of the world is doing and worrying about everybody else and caring about all this stuff that I don't need to care about. It's just extra baggage. So this is why I ask these questions about God. And I bring up these subjects. You see, debate is the best thing that we can do. But how many people will get offended and they will just block everything out that you're saying and they won't listen and then they will get all intimidated and and standoffish and oh no I got to cut you off. I can't listen to anything you're saying because you're going against God. <clears throat> you're a demon. You're a devil. I can't have you telling me these things. You see, I, I know how a lot of this works, and I'm not saying that's what you're thinking, but these are a lot of the things that I used to think, is that if somebody was telling me something that was different from what I believed or thought, that they were my enemy, or they were against me, or they were doing something to drive me away from my ultimate purpose, or driving me away from God, who I was chosen by, and I had to get rid of all that. I got rid of the ego. I got rid of the pride. I got rid of all of that boasting. Because that's what it is. And that's what I don't do. And if I catch myself doing that, I will catch myself. You know, if you ever hear me boasting about something, then call me out on it. You know, call me out on it. Because I... Don't want to boast. I just want to be a human being and be what I am. And that's what the SBN lifestyle is about. That's what I am about because I am my brand. And that's why I did my video, I am my brand. So all I can ask is that <clears throat> you question things. I have a saying that I made up.
believe nothing, question everything. And, you know, don't drive yourself crazy with this stuff. Just let it be and ask these questions and debate on it. We don't have to kill one another. We don't have to beat one another up. We don't have to, you know, do all these destructive things to one another because we're taking sides all the time. You know, oh, I'm not with this group, but I'm with that group. I don't agree with what they're saying. I agree with them and all that. And this is what the news and the media is constantly pumping out. And these elections and these, uh, you know, whatever you call them, Democrats, Republicans, uh, the political stuff going on, you know. And I know a lot of people are into that, but that's not my cup of tea. And I would not tell anybody to indulge in that because... To me, it's poison to the brain. It's complete poison to your individual self. So with that, I'm going to end the video here. It's already too long. I can't do videos more than 20 minutes. I don't know why it won't upload to YouTube. So be inspired by this. Create more by this. And be yourself. You know, remember that you're only human the SBN lifestyle later